<laughs> hey kids, Joe Weaver coming at you. You're watching Beaver Vision once again. And uh, as many of you know, I am also a musician. And music history is pretty important to me. And uh, I'm down at a place here in Cleveland, Tennessee, where I'm from. Um, but many people here may not know that John Philip Sousa played here 110 years ago. A place called Craig Mile Opera House. It is now uh, called Craig Mile Hall. And uh, many offices are in there, but... Uh, it's been restored, or at least the facade has been restored, to what it looked like when Sousa played here. It's really cool. Let's check it out. Right here is Craig Miles Opera House, where John Philip Sousa debuted The Diplomat. Very cool. And every Halloween, they usually stick a tall Betsy statue or something up there. Pretty cool. They have pretty awesome Halloween block parties down here. All right, let's see if we can go inside. Here's the marker on the front of the building. Talking about John Philip Sousa playing here. In 1906. 110 years ago. Windows showing the outside of the building. Also, as a side note, here uh, out in front of the courthouse, which is right across the street from Craig Miles, is uh, a band thing. And, uh, I believe the original was built in 1920, and they rebuilt it in 2005. And it has a little of my own history into it, too, because I sang at the dedication of this bandstand with the Bradley Central High School show choir back in the day. So this is a little side note at the end of it. Let's check this out. There's Craig Mile across the street. The courthouse is right back there. And this is pretty much my view from where I sang here, looking at this bell. Anyway, it doesn't get more American than John Philip Sousa. Except maybe like the Beach Boys or the Andrews Sisters. They're a little later. Yeah. 
Sigma. Anyway, John Philip Sousa played right there.